Yeah, I'm gonna record it real quick. Um, about how, uh, what's the, what's the, uh, gap between the two shots? What's your best guess? Uh, maybe 0.2 seconds, if even. Here, Chris, side. It's too damn fast. I love the uh, point fifty Beowulf rifle, but like an AR-15. <laughs> Fire that fully automatic. <laughs> oh, it did? It'll go on a standard AR-15 lower. Yeah, you just need to upper clip it on the lower. And, it's, uh, and what's funny is it uses standard AR-15 magazines so that only holds 10 rounds of 50 bail of I so. jammed the AC-20 on my second click after I let it run all the way down. So, but, fun uh, fact, fun I fact. did zero damage. I, I, uh, I, was, I wasn't trying to get you to do the ultra that mode, though. I didn't do it intentionally. I waited until it finished and then tried again and I jammed it. Here's another question for you, Wade. Why did they make the uh, 6.8 caliber? Basically to get replicate the ballistics of uh, AK-47, but basically improve upon it. And drills thing. So it's pretty much next, the next uh, 5x45? Uh, no, I'm if talking like what? the 30 caliber AKs. 7.62. Uh, 7 Basically, they wanted that hitting power in an AR-15 package. Yeah, yeah that's 5.56, five, five, right? Oh, uh, no, he's talking 6.5 and 6.8, you know, SPC, those rounds. Okay. Ultra 20, the cooldown starts on the third round. But it fires okay. five rounds. Yeah, it fires five rounds. About how long? Roughest guess on the... Uh, 0.5 seconds. Per shot? Half a second per shot? No, for the entire burst. Oh, how... okay, okay, so... Oh, starts... you're talking 6.5 grand all. 6.8. Oh, 6.5, yeah, yeah. Okay, the 6.5 is basically a... It, it is a higher caliber, but there's more of a flatter shooting round. It's more of a sniper round bit to, like, an AR-15. Very flat shooting. Gotcha. So is there a reason that, uh, well, the Bushmaster, whoever produced the ACR, still hate that name, but anyway. Is there a reason they produced that, uh, 6.8 rifle with 6.8? Uh, the 6.8 is, like I said, it's more of an attempt to get the 7.62 by 39 ballistics. Uh, the length of the rifle I just put up, that does a better job, that's an actual 30 caliber. Okay, this is fucked up. The AC2 gotcha. sounds better than the Ultra. Yeah, 300 AAC, it's an interesting round. There's actually two variants. There's 300 AC, AAC, and 300 Blackout. It's basically the same thing as 300 Blackout. There's another variant called 300 Whistler. It's actually all kind of the same thing. Gotcha. That is a very expensive rifle. Okay, I'm gonna start using the clan ACs. They sound a lot better. Alright, um, I'm basically, from what I'm guessing from uh, what you're saying, it looks like it's about a two second uh, duration for the I almost got it. <laughs> You're talking okay. 2,500 bucks in that area. Wow, really? The HK's very proud of their shit. Target I think they're okay. generally priced. Uh, but yeah, I was saying, talking about the 300 AC, AC, there's one variant called 300 Blackout that's basically a lower grain, high velocity cartridge. 120 grains, pretty much like your 762 by 39, but there's another one called uh, 300 Whisker, and it fires about a 250 grain uh, 
uh, slug. And the thing is, they slowed it, that, that heavy slug, it's slower, it's subsonic, so if you put a, a suppressor on that rifle, you won't hear it. Interesting. And the subsonic, well, in competition shooting or like hobby shooting, what, like subsonic is so that you don't have to wear uh, ear protection, or what? Subsonic, basically, if you put a suppressor on a firearm and shoot it, if it's a supersonic round, you'll still get a, a crack from it breaking the sound barrier. Gotcha. Uh, subsonic, basically, it's anything under about 1100 feet per second is about the borderline. A mm -hmm. 300 whisper, it's meant for like police, you like SWAT teams that would go in and clear a building. Or they put a suppressor on their rifles and they won't be blowing each other's eardrums out every time they shoot <laughs> the thing. Gotcha. So is that the reason that suppressors are used in like law enforcement, SWAT, whatever? Yeah. Gotcha. I mean, any home defense firearm, I feel, it would be best to have a suppressor on, but we have stupid rules regarding that. But we require people to put mufflers on their cars. Murder. <laughs> gotcha. But yeah, chances are if you fire it off anything more than maybe a 9mm indoors, God forbid a rifle without ear protection on, you'll probably blow your eardrums out. 